Hey guys, Chef Matthew Cooper from The Preacher's Son here. I always get asked how we cook our roasted cauliflower for the restaurant. So today, we're going to cook that and go through those steps and show you how it's made. It's really simple. All right guys, so we have uh, all of our ingredients for our roasted cauliflower right here. I have uh, our head of cauliflower. You take a half of cauliflower, you're just gonna cut it right in half. You've got in an easy way to take this off instead of cutting it, it's just to grab it right by the root right here and just break it off. That's perfect, just like that. All right, put that over there. We have some cilantro that we're gonna make our chimichurri with. That requires sea salt, olive oil, red wine vinegar, and some chili flakes. All right, we've got that. And then the only other thing we're gonna need for this is nutritional yeast. You can get this at most, uh, most grocery stores. It's packed full of vitamins. It's got a really nice cheesy flavor. All right, let's cook it. So we have our chimichurri made. Now all I did was chop up some parsley, equal parts parsley and cilantro. I actually only had cilantro, so uh, I just did that. And then you add olive oil or a neutral olive oil because you don't want it to overpower the cilantro uh, up to the point of the level of the cilantro and the, or the parsley in the container. And then you're gonna add red wine vinegar to taste, however acidic as you want it, and then salt and chili flake or chilies. You can leave those out if you don't want it spicy. And you mix it together until it's, until it's the right consistency and you like the flavor, all right? Now, I've got the oven preheated to 450 degrees because we want to roast this cauliflower really well. I'm gonna coat it with a little bit of olive oil and salt and that's it. I like to get a pan hot before I put it in the oven. Put a little bit of oil in the pan first. Put it down like that. We're gonna cover it with a little bit of oil, right? And then just a little bit of salt on the outside, and then it goes in the oven. So we're gonna pull it out in just a second. Okay, so the cauliflower's been in the oven for about 15 minutes at 450. We're gonna take it out. All right, cool. So we've got a little bit of caramelization, just like we want. Now you can take this even further. You can test it with some skewers, and you just want it to be just fork tender. You don't want it to be too overdone. Um, and different ovens are going to be different, so you're going to have to be specific to each, each one. And you take it as dark as you want, caramelize it much. The, again, the more you caramelize it, the more the sugars in that cauliflower is, are going to develop, and it's going to be a little bit sweeter. So there's our cauliflower. We've got our chimichurri right here. I like to go definitely heavy on that, and we're going to plate it really quickly. Pour that all over there. All right. Um, see a good quality sea salt or whatever you have at home and then nutritional yeast this is the good stuff right here and we just go ahead and coat that entire thing and then there you have it that's our roasted cauliflower